What's up, YouTube? This is the Billy Bob HD again, bringing you another Let's Play. Today, I've got some more Victoria 2 Heart of Darkness going, continuing our campaign as Austria. Last episode, we tried to fabricate a Casus Belli against Ukraine, which we now have. So, we can go ahead and attack them and try to annex them. Um, let's see. We're currently... We should be number five in the in the world in terms of great powers. Um, if we unpause it here, this should switch the ranking. There we go. Uh, we've got a slight lead on the Russians and pretty far behind the USA and France. So not much we can do there. We've got our research all teched out. Basically, we're working on finishing out our commerce. Um, yeah, so without further ado, let's try to annex Ukraine. Declare war. Conquest. Okay, none of my allies will join, so I'm not even going to try to uh, call them in. And that was pretty inefficient, but we'll go ahead and move the armies in. Three different stacks there. We'll try to make this quick so uh, no other countries try to join the war. Bump the speed up slightly. Oh. Ukraine did raise an army. I will take the prestige. Hell yeah. Um, conservative gain three militancy or liberal? We'll go with conservatives. Yeah. We have more liberals than conservatives. All right, nice. We're capping that territory. I guess the Ukraine mobilized at the very last second, and we are just inflicting crazy casualties. We won. All right, once we finish capping the capital here, Proskurov. We'll try to annex them. Hurry, 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 hurry. It's making me nervous. Got it. Alright. Pause. Propose peace. They would accept annexation, so proceed. Awesome. We just got this big chunk. Right, yeah. We'll take the consciousness. So nice, we've expanded the empire. Let's uh, pause it and take a look at what we've done so far in the campaign. Uh, very early, back in like the 1850s, 1860s, we uh, annexed this little portion of Italy here back before Italy even existed. Um, so we've got this piece. So Italy hates us forever because of that. We own their cores. Um, I was able to colonize and capture this whole Middle East area here. We built the Suez Canal. It's pretty sweet. And I own this little chunk here in Africa. Um, what else? I've got a bunch of, of uh, countries in my sphere. Ethiopia, Greece, Moldavia, Montenegro, Serbia, Wallachia, and Xinjiang. Move on to that next technology. And yeah, we do have some infamy to burn off, so 16 infamy. I'm still allied with the Brits and the Russians. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Okay, so we can influence Belgium, Switzerland, Paraguay. We'll go to Belgium. Try to grab them into our sphere. Paraguay, let's go over here. Hmm, right there. Increase opinion there. Alright, there was a crisis going on in Afghanistan. 
it did not generate any interest at the moment. So that would be somewhere over here. Bukhara. Bukhara. Um. Oh, wow. National decisions. We can do the National Banking Act. I don't want to do that because it lowers my tax efficiency. Uh, we can enact women's suffrage. Lose to, to war exhaustion. Sure, why not? I do not want to sign the um, Geneva Convention either because it lowers my maximum military spending. <laughs> and restore academia, I lose 15 prestige, so I'm not going to do that either. But we did enact women's suffrage, so that's pretty cool. Alright, so something else that we can do is we can build another build another army here, so let's do that. Get off the guards. We'll get some regular infantry going as well. Um, we definitely want some artillery and some cavalry. Uh, three airplanes, maybe four. And we'll try to build a tank even though we haven't been able to in the past, so we'll try that. I wonder if the Germans have tanks yet. Anyway, my guys look pretty cool as we've advanced technologically. Ooh, it looks like Poland has a pretty nasty rebellion going on. Poland likes us. Yeah, Poland likes a lot of people, though. So Montenegro keeps asking for an alliance, and I really don't want to because they're in my sphere. Serbia is a satellite of mine, which is nice. Alright, so we killed that technology. Let's go ahead and grab that. Yeah. Um, twenty percent more socialist, yeah. All right, send you over to Vienna with the rest of the guys. Yeah. Um, Poland. Increase opinion. How about UK? They still like us. Uh, Russia, not a lot going on. We'll increase relations. And how about Germany? See, Germany really likes us too. Um, okay, so I've got a rebellion that just popped up. Yeah. So let's get rid of all of these pop-ups. But Germany would not accept an alliance with me. It's okay. Okay, so the Brits got this piece of the Middle East here. Um, I was thinking about trying to invade Persia, but I just noticed they're allied with the UK. So we don't want to do that. Um, oh, wow, lots of rebellions. Jeez. We crushed them pretty easily, though. The Austrian fascists. Take you up here, kill that rebellion. Um, what else? What else? 
anything down here in Italy to worry about? No. I just have a 45 stack sitting here and the Italians huh. the Italians are just loaded up on the border there. Nice, I got plus 20% diplomatic influence. Alright, so we can do a refarm. 23% of the people want acceptable minimum wage. 2% for the workday. 2% there. 3% there. 2%. 2%. So we'll go with minimum wage. How about the Ottomans? That stinks. Hmm. UK would join me against the Ottomans. That's interesting. Even without a Cassus Belly. So the Empire has grown. Pretty sizable here on the mainland. I would love to grab Poland, but... That alliance with Japan is just absolutely ridiculous. I was hoping that would end sometime. How about Albania? No, the Brits are all over Albania. Um... Let's look at the scores. So the Russians are gaining on me, it looks like. That kind of sucks. How are the Russians doing? They grabbed this piece of China. Interesting. Uh, who's this here? Taiping Republic. in Japan. North Borneo. Yeah, we want Jingoism. Um, Maturia exists. Okay, so we've got a uh, we've got a crisis that's popped up on our own territory. Ooh. The Russians are pushing for Poland to gain territory from me. What the hell, Russians? I thought we were friends. The USA has grabbed Alaska. Colombia still exists as an independent country. But, mm. um... Hmm... Yeah. Independent country, but in the U.S. sphere. Canada. Under British control. Got Iceland and Greenland here under Danish control. Interesting. Alliance offer from Ethiopia. Okay. We'll unpause it. Alright, so no other great powers have jumped into the crisis quite yet. Uh, France went onto the Russian side. If I can get Britain, which I just did, that's great. There we go. Nice. Britain came over to my side. If Germany comes over, well, hold on. Okay, they would not accept a white piece. Ooh. With Germany being Britain's ally, I'm hoping they'll come over to my side here. Uh, Persia's requesting military access. No thanks, buddy. Going back to the crisis. Come on, Germany. I want to get a bunch of prestige. 
All right, so we finished all of these tech levels out. Now all I have to do is finish out my navy. And then we can build a navy. A modern navy. What's going on here in Spanish Africa? Revolts. Revolts. Um, what else? Let's see. Free trade. Ooh, Italy went against me, but Germany came along with me. So since Germany came over, they would accept a peace offer. Um, let me pause that here. Yeah, we just took that. I don't want to start a world war. I don't know if I'd be able to gain any territory either, so... Um, yeah, it was for this area here. Galatia. Alright, so I've got a 96 stack sitting here. How about the army? Yeah, we're still... Still waiting on these tanks to start. At least it's starting construction, which is nice. Austrian tanks. Oh, Persia's trying to... Interesting. Persia's coming in here against Bukhara. And they're at war with Japan as well. They don't have a... S Ooh. Decreased relations with them. See, all I have is this little fleet here. I can hold 20 weight, which means 60,000. I can hold a 60 stack. Oh god, now the communists have risen. Go away, communists. We're crushing that rebellion. Alright, hold up. Take you, move you there. Combine these Italian uh, regiments and then ugh, all of the pop-ups. Death by pop-ups. There we go. Cool. New technology. Go with oil-driven ships. Alright, so it looks like we killed off any remaining rebellions. Yeah. Nice. We will decrease relations again. I was trying to, yeah, take my influence away. Airplane, nice. Got some airplanes going. So I'm hoping the Ottomans cannot handle these uprisings in Bosnia. If they are able to break off from the Ottoman Empire, I'm going to move in there. This This area here. Yeah, we'll go to the Olympics. Hell yeah. Uh, what 
else. I wish I could annex these guys here. Moldavia, Wallachia. The only reason they still exist is because the Ottomans continue to hold them as satellites even in 1931. Jeez. Um, Alright, so we can do a reform. Nobody really wants this stuff. Except for secret ballots. There we go. Influence Switzerland, Peru, Uruguay, Poland. Let's go over here to Peru. Increase opinion. Paraguay. Oh. It's Uruguay, excuse me. There we go. Who else is trying to get into the mix there? Besides me. Looks like it's just me. Huh. Another airplane. There we go. So once we update the navy here, I want to just get a, like a really baller modern navy going. Alliance offer from Montenegro, no thanks. Um, got some rebellions in Moldavia up here. Yeah, so. We'll decrease relations one more time with the Persians. They still don't uh, have any allies. That's nice. How's South America looking? Pretty much the same. Italy hates us, France hates us. The Russians like us. Even though they keep trying to uh, screw around with my, my eastern territories here. How about Norway? Okay. In the German sphere. Sweden. Of course in the Russian sphere. Okay. Paul, I don't even know where that is. We got a Cassus Belli against them. Poland and Switzerland. Switzerland, uh, interesting. Over time, Switzerland has come over to the Italian side of things rather than um, France. France was all over this. Uh, what about the Dutch? Ooh, they're in the Italian hands as well. Alright, hold up. The Russians are calling us into a war against Bukhara. Already occupied. So we'll accept. Who's Bukhara allied with? No one. That's fine. We'll enter the war and just not help. We'll be lazy. Yeah, see, that already pieced out, I guess. War still going between per Persia and Bukhara. Let's see. Acquire a state, 11 infamy. That's going to put me right at the limit. I'm going to have to wait. Damn it. We're going to have to wait. Maybe for next episode. 
Anyway, um, thanks for watching. This is where we're going to cut it. But um, again, this has been the Billy Bob HD. Please remember to like, subscribe, and comment if you've enjoyed my content. And we will catch you next time. Thanks, folks.